What is up everyone? Welcome back to a new video. It's been a while since I did a sub collection video, been about a year. I did it last year around January. So I'm bringing it back. My boy Crescendo sent me a video of his human made collection. We're gonna just jump right into it. Yeah, I haven't really watched it. Well, I really, I haven't watched it at all. I've just seen what I've just seen on the thumbnails or the videos. We're gonna just jump right into it. So let's get into it. Hey, this is Crescendo. Um, I wanna thank Mac for letting me show my collection because I love human made and other, you know, street wares and everything, but I want to get into just no problem. my collection of the stuff I collected. I'm gonna say this, when I first started collecting human made, my corner looked like that times two. I had a whole bunch of boxes in my room. Now, most of them were downstairs in the garage. So when I resell stuff, I just repackage it and put it back in the same box that I got them in. But yeah, my corner used to look exactly like this. All right, so here we go. We got some of the human race shoes from Pharrell Williams. I like those. It is really hard to find these in a size 15. Jesus, Very 15. Hard. So if anyone has, anyone has like a pair or like a plug or anything yeah, and stuff where I can find these in a size 15. Jesus. Because Big I already foot. wear a 14. <laughs> So we're in a size 15 because you know they fit, they run small for some reason. I don't know why, yeah, but it is what it is. Kind of tight. I have these crates right here. Let's see my Got crates. that one for Father's Day. Got this one right here. Just have them for display. So there's nothing in half of these. I got a lot of stuff in my crates. I use mine. Have that one. Mainly storage stuff in there. The storage stuff. I don't and I have the big one right here. Which has the Ultra Boost. I have this one right here. Which I feel like is like a really slept on shoe. I was gonna get those, that. but they sold out. They're Tokyo time. Solars, which I really like. Love how these are made. Okay. So after that, we're gonna go over to the other side. All right. Hey, I see so that. So I have, like I said, I have the the rugs. Two everything. Blizzies. I'm gonna clean it up after I get done with this video. I need that. This one, room's though. a mess. I already know. I need a tiger rug. I already know. Have a bunch of my studio equipment here. I have a picture of my family. His daughter's so adorable. Adorable. And a bunch of records over here. Like he I said, it's a mess. Pictures of her on his Instagram. <laughs> She's so funny, yo. Uh, I bought this tote bag because I've seen like the Nego <laughs> and the uh, Pharrell one, but I've never seen this one. I've seen that one. So I was doing a little bit of research on that one, and it's uh, Nady, Nate, Nadia or Naya. I think that's her name. So it she is. came up with a collab with Nego, and she had, I think it was a button up shirt, a t shirt, and it was a Yokosuka jacket. And the tiger. This rug, I've been trying to get this rug for the longest, and I just cannot find it. And if I do find it, the resale is going to be ridiculous. Probably like $600, $800. So I'm just passed. So I may never get this rug unless I get a good lick or a trade or something. Rug is dirty. Sorry. Shout out to Bay from Dave. I used to buy We have this one right here. From Bay from Dave. Some Bape. Few of the calls. T-shirts. Like I said, I, I just have like a bunch of stuff everywhere. I just brought it down here just to show you guys. Have this Black Lives Matter tee from, from Verdi. Okay. Thought it was a, I just like the font on this. Yeah, I like the Verdi font. A lot. Let's see. I have the Billionaire Boys Club jacket. I forgot what season this was, so I don't want to like, you know, try to say, oh, it's from season five or season six and stuff. But the reason why I bought it, because I love that. I wanted to use that for an album cover or something. I like it, though, it's clean. Human made. Yeah. The polar those, bear. Those hoodies are heavy. I'm telling you, those were heavy hoodies. Shit on the floor after spending so much money on this. <laughs> They're going to butcher me in the comments. <laughs> You'll be all right. Keep it made again. Yep. Yeah, so I really wear all this, man. 
I wear this sometimes at work. On and it really doesn't matter. Because I only have like one day off, so like I just wear it. You got to get L. We on have that. The calls. Took an L on that shirt. Calls made. He got lucky. I got the pillow though. I'm gonna talk about that later in another video. And one of my first jean jackets. Hey. With human made. Selling one of mine. I'm trying to find like another one so I could be done with that collection because like everything runs kind of small. And I'm kind of a big guy. This sweatshirt. Basic. The loose fitting one. Somebody don't have the gray sweatshirt, just This football jersey, Central. which I really love this color. Like a mustard yellow. Here's for futuristic teenagers. Human made. I'm I'm terrible. It's like the it's like looking at the Blair Witch Project. But yeah, it's a mustard yellow, but it's pretty hey, cool. I'm I need to lose some weight so I can wear this properly. I hit the gym, big dog. Um, Bape, once again. I'm a big fan of the teriyaki boys. I ain't wear Bape in so long. Since high school. Bape General. Love this t-shirt. Ooh. Okay. Hang on. Oh, oh, what's going on here? Okay. Oh, oh, oh. There we go. Got that right there. Really doesn't matter to me if it's old or new. As long as they have like a decent print. I hate a Majora mask. Y'all see that? This t-shirt I would not probably never give away because it reminds me of my grandmother. Mm. Uh, my grandmother got me into like Japanese movies like Godzilla and like, you know, hell, she even watched animes with me. So rest in peace to her. And she loved this t-shirt. See, that's pretty dope. Like he actually had like sentimental value to these clothes that mean something. Like he just told a story about his grandma liking that shirt because she got him into like Japanese movies and anime. Like I can relate to that because my mom she got me into anime when i was like in the fifth grade like she's like yo matt come here watch this um cartoon and the cartoon was dragon ball z and ever since then been hooked on anime thanks to my mom and she still watching it to this day so i can see why he has sentimental value to that that's, that's pretty cool um let's see a kid cuddy tea because i'm not about to pay 1400 for the original one jesus no thank you 1400 yeah. star trek Oh, that's hard. That's a hard. You coast know, I'm a, I'm a fan. So, look at that. That coast jacket. If you know, hard. you know. Temple, maybe white coast jacket. Uh, human made once again. I remember it when look it dropped. That. I like that. One of their button ups. One of his button ups. Really like this one. I don't really like the duck too much, but when he does a decent job, I'll try to get it. Word. <laughs> I'm sorry that this is all over the place. I'm sorry, guys. Uh, right. love the digi flannel shirt. <clears throat> love this. This button up is like one of my favorites. It's super wrinkled right now, but it's been in my closet. Yeah, be all right. <laughs> this was given to me by JP. If you, I actually like this design a lot. As simple as it is, I like this design a lot. Just the art style is just dope. You got that Western, like, um, cartoon art style going on. I really like that a lot. It's like, it's like from the 1940s and 50s. I, I really do like that art style. No, you know, this guy was there, you know, the reason why I started collecting is basically because of him. If you know, you know. Also the guy JP, I did, a, um, I went on live with him on my Instagram a while back and that was a really good live video. It's I have it on my YouTube page. If y'all want to watch it, we talk about a whole bunch of like um, clothing stuff about like Japanese brands and denim and Nego and a whole bunch of other stuff. So if y'all want to check that out, it's somewhere on my um, like on my on um, somewhere on my YouTube. Y'all can find it. it. It's on there. Trust me. Just look for it, you'll find it. But JP is really cool dude. Cactus Plant Flea Market and his, merch. And his collection is crazy. Yeah. So. Love some That's of That's hard. I like that. All right. This one. Sorry that the video cut out. I got this uh, rain jacket. For a 2XL, this fits even larger. Mm. All right. So, Kanye oh. Bear, my beautiful Dark Twisted Fantasies. Yo, I need that. We got I the Graduation need Bear. That. We have. I need them bears, bro. Claws. Small eyes. Them bears are hard. All right. Let's get into the shirts. Bit. Boop. There we go. We got this one right here. I remember I don't know when if that you dropped. guys can see that. I remember when exactly oh. when that dropped. There we go. Got that one right there. 
that's just uh i just like the print on that one i thought that one was pretty cool then we have the nerd well star trek one we got that i want the hoodie of that i want the hoodie version <laughs> instead of t version I don't think a lot of people have that one. They but, don't. Yeah. They I'm don't. Such a Star Trek fan, so <clears throat> thought that was kind of cool. Then we have the calls made. Once Damn. again, I am so sorry. I'm doing this one. I'm not gonna lie. I took a big L on the cause human made collab because every time, like, I had about four things in the in my cart, and as soon as I'm gonna go check out, the capture just pops up on the screen. And when you try to like submit like the capture, like select all the buses that you see in this capture so i select the buses hit like submit but it don't take me to the damn cart and check out it just screws me over and the screen just look weird everybody had an issue with human made and i took an l because of capture on the um human made and uh cause collab so i took a major l because of that Damn. chris Paul's got made. lucky chris Boom. got real there lucky we, go. we have the server cat which I honestly really didn't like this one too much. I didn't like the I didn't like the Civic Cat that much either because I, I had this exact t-shirt but the white version I sold it. I think they could do a little bit more with this uh, Civic Cat and I do have an idea that I'm going to do dealing with this Civic Cat in my next uh, by design video which I think will be pretty dope. They gonna have nothing to do with clothes when I do this next design. It's gonna be an actual product that I'm gonna try to create, all uh, based around a Civic Cat, which is gonna be really cool. Just stay tuned for that. It's all right, but it yeah. is what it is. Yeah. Then we have Girls Don't Cry. Hey. Little Vic, right there. I got. It. That's the character's name. His name is Vic. You got so one hanging up right now. Not that, that one, but the other version. It was all right. Of it. I'm always gonna keep this t-shirt because, well, basically, yeah, my daughter was born and I was wearing this t-shirt, so I'm gonna mm. keep this one. If you know, you know. That's a good reason to keep the shirt <laughs> around, to be honest. Let's Damn, see. how many shirts you got, man? This one from Cold Coffee. One of my favorite designs. I love I like this that. design. From, uh, I think is either Mr. Mr. or Mr. Por no, Mr. Mr is the guy who made this one. Love this design. It was so funny because like, I was like, oh, this is a dope ass design. And then next thing you know, I see like Pharrell wearing this one. I was like, oh shit, this is dope. I think I remember <laughs> seeing him wearing that too. <clears throat> Bought this one in Miami. Yeah, when I went to Miami, that was like the first one I saw. I was like, I love this font. Yeah, then, can't go wrong let's with see. It. I just like that. Look, I oh, thought that Patagonia. was pretty cool. That's the uh, Patagonia. If you, you guys know what this is, come on. If you, right if, you, if you know what it is, you, you, you know. Blanket I shouldn't right have there. to, you know, school everybody on this. A old curry up tea. Throwback. I don't know what season this is. Sorry, it's super wrinkled. All right, so we got the tiger tea right here. I got that we tea. We got the girls don't cry. Took an L on that tea. We have the Beatles. Not too much of a fan of that. We have a polar bear tea. Can't go wrong with that. We have a Studio 7 tea. I want that tea. That leather jacket fire too. We have my, sec um, my second t-shirt. Sorry, it's super wrinkled. We have a pig tea. Not a fan <laughs> of the pig. I'm not a fan uh, of that. We have the curry up one. Used to love this graphic. <laughs> love that. We have a... One of the newer ones. Look at that. Boom. Had that tea. We resold go. it. Have that. This one wasn't too bad. I felt like they, he could have did better with this one. I think my first tea was this tea, or it was something similar to this tea, if I'm not mistaken. Super wrinkled, but yeah. I'm going to probably just like iron these later or something. Mm. Beatles tea. Yeah, this is like my second one. We have a tiger. It's like one of my favorites. I got the black one. I sold my white one. That's kind of cool. I kind of regret it. A date tea. Love the yellow on this one. Pop. A tiger. <laughs> uh, this one's pretty cool too. 
That's another date tea. I kept buying date teas for some reason. Yeah, I got a few I need to reset. Um, Japanese Solidarity. One of my favorite logos. I need Love it. Love this logo. I just need one. I think that's one of cool. those Storm Cowboys tees. And I bought this other date tee because this is my daughter's birthday. Some more sentimental. That's the third sentimental piece she got, bro. Yeah, that one. I'm uh, Girls Don't Cry. I took an L one. Of on my favorite this one. tees. I just packed everything up real quick. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Are you good, dog? This one right here. And this one. I think this was the last oh. one. So I actually wear all my stuff. So it looks a little faded. Sorry. Yeah, I appreciate that, though. And I'm terrible at folding. So hopefully you guys like this video. I got to no, clean like up this it. room. It was Turn different. this into a studio. Thank you, Mac, once again. Thank all of you. And support Mac and his, uh, and his new clothing brand. I love hey, it. Hey, thank you for saying that. Please go pick up a hoodie down below. The link is to the website down below if y'all want to pick up a hoodie. They're $50. I got a lot more stuff coming. I'm tweaking the name a little bit just to make it a little bit more unique. But anyway, thank you all for watching. Like, come subscribe down below. I got a lot more of these videos coming. Crescendo, thank you for sending me the footage of your collection. I want to do more of these. I want to be more engaging with my subscribers. I want y'all to show off like what y'all got going on and show off y'all collection and things like that. A lot more cool stuff coming on the way. Still going to be doing some more design stuff for Human Made. Yeah. So, yeah. That'll be it. Catch y'all next video. Thank you, Chris. I'm out. Peace.